All right, Coach, quick turnaround from one Sunshine State Conference game to another. Got Florida Tech on Tuesday night. Talk to us about your thoughts on the game. Oh, it's good and bad, right? You know, we got to get back at practice today. We took yesterday off, you know, because we play at Eckerd on Saturday as well. And, you know, it's good to get right back on the horse. Uh, we played an awful fourth quarter, unfortunately. Uh, we got to make some adjustments and uh, get our mojo together and be ready for tomorrow night's game. And even when you look at Saturday's game against PBA, there were still a couple of season highs. Kiki McIntyre got 26 points. You guys recorded a team high of 11 steals. And going up against the Florida Tech team that hasn't played as much as we have 10 games versus the six, including exhibition games, you know, what does that, what kind of matchup do you prepare for for a team that hasn't played as much as you have? Well, he's a good coach uh, that's been in this business a long time. So those guys are always ready. Um, they shoot the ball really well. They got some length. Um, they'll be prepared uh, regardless of their amount of games they played. They always play hard. They always compete. And like I said, he does a good job with them. Uh, you know, we be, we got to get uh, our minds right and uh, get back to where we were, per se. And I think we'll be okay. It's been a great season so far, Coach. And despite Saturday, does it seem like there's a monkey off the back a little bit now that there's a loss in the realm of the schedule? You know, we talk about it. Uh, and it was mentioned in the locker room. And, you know, it's good to get a check and, you know, things you got to things you gotta fix. Like, we weren't very good being double teamed. Uh, we, we aren't getting enough touches for our post players. Uh, they exposed us for not being as physical at times. But, you know, here's a game where we're up 12 with two minutes to go in the first half, and we let the game get away. So we got to close out quarters better, and we got we to gotta finish games better, even in our wins. You know, so you expose yourselves for things you got to fix. And like I said, I was talking to Lance in an alumni meeting today. It's every night any SSC team can get you. I mean, it's, the conference is that good. The basketball is that good. And people play hard and people want to win. You know, so I think my ladies will be okay. And then as we we talked about in other pregame interviews, obviously outside of a win, what's some of the takeaways you would like to see as you guys try to rebound and get back on track in Sunshine State Conference play? You know, we always want to improve our defense, at least one aspect of it. Uh, right now, we've had a couple games where we fussed a little bit offensive and defensive rebounding. <clears throat> so we're going to make a jump tomorrow to be in a plus category again. And, uh, you know, we got to get a couple other guys going. Like you mentioned Kiki earlier. That's phenomenal. You know, that's a third guard. Uh, and uh, Sash off the bench has been an energy rabbit and has been a glue kid for us. Uh, so... Be nice to see you. I think you'll see a little different out of uh, our post play and our other players. Uh, Elaine, Elaine Harris is someone I uh, talk about a lot and, and uh, demand a lot out of and count on. And she, she's going to be there for us. You're going to see. And then, you know, the future development of the rest of the team, including Jamoke. So uh, I'm hoping to see some of them things.